This is Sports Center. And this game is underway. We have Diddy on the red team and we have Shockey P on the blue team. How you feeling about today, Michael? Well, you know, Diddy's style, the way that he uh, snipes shit and guns back in the corner and he puts the healing staff on him, I really like his technique. Well, you know, um, Michael, the Shockey P, the way he attacks, he's pretty straightforward. You know, a lot of people like to limit him just to say that he's only good with his staff. But we've seen him and we've seen him play and we know that he has real skill. What do you think about that, Michael? Well, well, you know, um, I do agree about that. But, you know, I think that what people don't understand is that how underrated Diddy is. Well, uh, Michael, we're ready to get this uh, match underway. Um, we're, waiting for, we're waiting for Diddy right now. They're getting things sorted out on the field. Um, and once everything is set out on the field, we should be we should have uh, um, Shaft of Wolf. He'll be there to be able to uh, speculate. Oh, oh, it looks like the match is underway. Let's go ahead and, and, and get it underway. Um, and Diddy is opening it up. I guess he's looking to see if he can find a way to up oh, there. Shocky right there. Oh, well, yeah, you know, oh, there he is. Oh, man, it looks like Shocky P has got the first kill. He's on the way up. Looks like he's going to go take the flag. Yeah, you know, you see, oh, there, and they're at it again. The 1v1. Oh, Diddy is back in the spawn. He is trying to get his healing up. Looks like he's going to reload his sniper. If he was smart, he would reload his sniper. Oh, he reloaded his sniper. Oh, there he goes. Shocky P sniped him. Man, you know, that kid really has some serious aim. You know what I really love about him? Oh, my. Two to zero. Looks like it's, it's, it's two kills and, and Diddy none. You know what I really love about that kid? The fact that he, can, when, when, when he's under pressure, he can just jump up and down and jump up and down. And he really knows how to use that energy drink. I've noticed that with a lot of players don't really know how to do that. Yeah, yeah, you are right about that, John. I, I don't know if Diddy should just be running up on Shocky P like that. He needs to be more of a technique. Well, it looks like he's doing that now. He sees him because I think he's looking for Diddy. But Diddy, but Diddy, but look at how he's just charging Shocky. He knows he's not going to be able to just charge him like that and think he's going to get away with it. Well, you never know. You can't underestimate Diddy. Oh, well, there's one with Diddy and Diddy's got the flag. Well, you you, you are right. I, I You can't underestimate this kid. This, this out of nowhere is Shockey. There he is with the machine gun to make sure he has really good defense. Well, you know what Shockey really needs to do right now? He needs to open it up over there because that's where he has his real specialty. Once he has the whole map open, up and they're at it again. And there's the 1v1 up. He puts the health kick and Shockey is at it again. So it looks like Diddy, he's a little bit under pressure. I don't know. Uh, how, how do you feel about who's who's today's sponsor today? Uh, Speaking of today's sponsor, we actually have Lil Snow Money here performing his new hit single, Inferno Staff. What do you want from Chris Malana, Inferno Staff? What do you want from Chris Malana, Inferno Staff? What do you want from Chris Malana, Inferno Staff? What do now let's get right back into the action. Looks like Shocky P, he went ahead and put Diddy in the dirt again. So, uh, I don't know, man. I think Diddy, he's really good. He, he, he does really good under pressure. Oh, and that is another point for Diddy. Good job, Diddy. I think he's really good. I, I, I think that right now he's just under pressure. Um, he needs, I don't know if he, he's, he's just, you know, he's, he's, I know he has a really good team. He's got a really good camp. I know they've been, been to work and getting preparing for this match. And, um, ooh, that would have been an easy snipe. He slipped away. I don't know if he slipped away from the mouse, but that's not a smart thing for, oh, he goes right into the crack so he can get bird's eye view to see where Shocky P is coming. But one thing about Shocky, what makes him such an intelligent player, he knows how to know where you are. So if you're in the little cracks and crevices, what he does is he pulls out that drill and he goes straight through. Um, so it's really good to see that you know he's he's utilizing those skills that he has but i don't think that was a smart move for diddy to go out around shocky like that and, and getting headshot like that i don't i don't know if that's something that but but it looks like oh he's getting the flag again one thing i can say diddy is putting up a fight he knows that this kid is is got plenty of more hours than he does but he is still adamant about giving it his best and that's one thing that i can say about this kid what you what do you have to say about that michael 
Well, yeah, you know, I think that Diddy, he's pretty good at what he does. I think that he's a, a very most improved player. It's And what I like about this kid is the fact that he's willing to go against the best, the elite, the number one pro players in this game and still give it his all and, and, and still push through so he can be able to claim some sort of dominance over the, the class that he's in. So I will give Diddy that and the fact that he's not afraid to go up on Shocky P. You know, a lot of people, you, they, there's different techniques, you know, John. There's different techniques that you can do and to utilize to win, you know. And, and one thing about Diddy is Diddy, he doesn't back down from a fight. And that's one thing I do like about him. So, um, yeah. But so uh, Diddy's opening up the map right now. It looks like he's uh, got all his weapons, his ammo, everything is uh, uh, reloaded. Oh, hey, oh, that was a really good body shot from Diddy. And, and, and it's so crazy to me just to see how he's able to even get a couple kills or, or kill, period, on Shockey. You know, Shockey's coming from a, a, a very pro class. So the fact that he's able to, you know, manage this fight is, you know, some sort of ground to speak on. Yeah, yeah, I, I do agree with that. I do agree with that, uh, Michael. Ooh, looks like that was a big lag. Uh, I think they're going to call a timeout on this one. Uh, yeah, yeah, Diddy's called the timeout. His team's called the timeout. Uh, looks like the refs, they're looking to see what happened right there. Uh, okay, so they figured out, yeah, it was a lag. It was a lag. Okay, cool. So the match is back on. Um, Diddy's going to go back to his spawn. Shock is getting back into a position. He's going to get reloaded. Oh, and they're back. Uh, yeah, you know, I, I really I, I really commend these these kids, man. The, the Just the effort and the time and the commitment that they put in these matches. You know, I just think that I think that it's, it's, it's something that, you know, a lot of people just don't do. He should heal up right now. Uh, Diddy should. Oh, OK. And he heals up. That's how you know that kid has IQ. But he still loses that 1v1. I, I mean, th this kid still has a lot more room to grow. He's only been on the game for, you know, 10 months. So. The fact that he's able to play with an elite player and, you know, kind of give this elite player a, a little bit of run for their money, even though that this is probably lightweight for Shockey. At the same time, you know, Diddy, he's doing his thing, and I would have to give him some credit for that for sure. I think that he does have a little bit of things that he needs to work on. I think that he doesn't need to re rush Shockey because Shockey is not the person you rush. Looks like it's a little bit of lag there as well. It looks like we've, we've had some people join. I think, uh, let's see who's joined. Uh, Shadow... Oh, wait, no. Oh, Shafter Wolf is here. Shafter Wolf's here. Looks like he's going to be the one that's going to be spectating. Uh, looks like it's a couple of other people that's here as well. Uh, so, yeah, man. This this, this is good job, Diddy. Good job, Diddy. That was a really good kill. The, the jump in, and Diddy was still able to keep that consistent aim on Shockey and, and still able to preserve his target. That is that is what I'm very adamant about, and, and that's what I really like about him and his character. So, um, looks like they are... Uh, trying to figure out what's going on i think there's a lag right now so there's another timeout that's called in the game um so let's 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 take a look let's take a quick look at some of the replays that we have here Okay, it's a good thing they got it sorted out. I believe Shaft, it helped Diddy out to try to figure out what they can do so they can be at least finish the match. That was really smart for Diddy to go into that little corner right there but and, and, and do that body shot on Shockey. Shockey pulls out the med kick. So does Diddy keep that target? Uh, uh, uh. And Shockey still wins. That's one thing I can say about that kid. That kid, he really knows how to lock on. I, I think, look, uh, and you can see the, the, the spectators on the sideline. One thing I can say about Shockey, he's really, really, really really good he's like a human aimbot he knows how to keep a target no matter what you do he will not let up on you and that's one thing i i would say takes a lot of hard work and a lot of training so i commend these boys for really really giving it their best and really giving us a really good performance what do you have to say about that michael yeah well you know i've been a big fan um for shockey when he was in the teenage years when 
You know, they were in um, Junior Wars, you know, back in the day. And I, I've, I've really been watching this kid for a very long time. And just to see where he is right now really just shows the extent of the, the extent, extent of his team. Uh, you know, and it's it's just it's just really good. And I think this right here with Diddy being such a young player in the game, this is really going to help him in the long run being able to compete with other players, you know, that's on the pro level. You know, so, you, you know, what I would... I would equate this match to be somebody like maybe a, a, a Javante Tank Davis going against a Floyd Mayweather, you know, um, somebody that's undefeated, that, you know, that's really good at what they do and, and, and just a professional and very elusive player. Not only elusive, but, you know, one hell of a player. That's one thing I can say. And, 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 and like I said, he's giving it his all. So... You, you can't really do anything but take your hat off and, and you know, while they play. Um, so, so there's, it looks like they're still trying to figure some things out here. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just really excited to be here, to be able to actually see this, witness it firsthand. Uh, you know, it, it, it it's one hell of a 1v1. I mean, I haven't seen any 1v1s like this in a very, very long time. This is one that I would, you know, would definitely go down in the books. I don't even think Shockey's done a 1v1, and I don't I don't know. It's probably, he hasn't even probably done one. This might be his first one this year. I would have to go back and check. Yeah, actually it is, John. This is Shockey's first 1v1, and it's crazy because... 1v1s are totally different than actually being in the match of, of, of a whole lot of people. And I think this is going to also help the spectators and the detractors that always talk about that that kid Shockey doesn't have any skills, that he only relies on AOE or he only relies on the staff. As you can clearly see, he's relying on his pure skills. And, and, and people don't know that a staff is actually a hard weapon to master. You know, um, and that's one thing I can say about Diddy. I've seen him compete and he's had that staff and he struggles with it. So, uh oh, and, and that's a kill by Diddy. I just think that, you know, that kid, he's, you know, but, but, but you know what they say, though, Michael. They say that the better you are at the game, the more hate you're going to get, the more flag you're going to get. They're going to find things and flaws about your gameplay. So um, that just means that he's the best at what he does. Yeah, you're right about that. Well, there's 40 seconds left in the game. Well, we can just go ahead and call this a, a, a game. We already know who won this. Uh, Shockey took it home, which is a good thing that Diddy didn't get blown out because it could have easily been a 10-0. to 0. Yeah, but I think that if Shockey really wanted to, he could have went and got the flag. And uh, Yeah, well, well, I don't know. Looks like Diddy's really been giving some really good defense. Well, yeah, uh, everything is hearsay, you know, but it looks like Oh, it looks like the game just paused or the match just paused. So it's, it's really a really big lag that's going on right now in the game, but the game is over. Um... These players did a really good job, and yeah, let's let's do, let's go to the interviews. Okay, Young, you really put on a really good performance. Please tell us what it is that you did, and how did you think you did? Well, you know, I really think that uh, I did my best. I, I gave it my best shot. He he was just really good, and every time I went around in the corners to kind of creep around, and, and you know, I would put up. You know, just so I can get a, like a quick scope on him, I was already respawned in, in, in my spawn. So there was just certain things that I that I know that I'm going to have to improve on. Me and my team, we have everything recorded. We're going to go back. Um, you know, we're going to go. We're going to go back to the um, to, to the stadium, and we're going to look at the footage, review everything, and, and just try to see what it is that maybe next time we can do better on. So that's kind of where I am at with it. Um, so um, that's that's. That sounds really good. I think you guys did a really good job. So, um, what do you think about just, you know, your overall gameplay in general? Well, yeah, like I said, my overall gameplay, I would give myself like a, a, maybe a D minus. Oh, um, but w w I will give myself some credit some as well milk. because I did learn on what I can do better on. Okay, thank you. Let's take it to, uh, take it to Shockey. Thank you. Shockey, you really took this victory home. So just tell me, what do you think about your overall gameplay? <laughs> I'm Shocky P. What do I expect? I'm the greatest. Can't no one defeat me. I mean, at the end of the day, he did okay. But at the same time, what did he think it was gonna be? He thought he was gonna go home with the W? Ha <laughs> He's mistaken. Okay, Shocky, well that sounds really good. You played really, really well. And um, yeah, is there anything else you wanna say? What are we to look forward to? Yes. 
I will be doing tournaments again pretty soon. Make sure you guys tune in for our tournament that's coming up. I am the number one national leader throughout the whole country and can't no one defeat me. And on top of that, yes, you detractors who try to say that I'm only good with the staff. As you saw, I used my sniper in a minigun and I still own Diddy. <laughs> Okay, well, you did so good, and back to you, Jess.